Hey guys, this is Malinki. Welcome back to my channel, Voice of Malinki. Today we will talk about mechanism of peptide hormone. And if you are new in my channel, please subscribe my channel. And if you like my video, please do like, comment, and share my video. So peptide hormones are water soluble and unable to cross the lipid barrier that is plasma membrane of a target cell. Hence, they act on the surface of target cells via second messengers. Peptide hormones bind G protein couple receptors or GPCRs on the target cell membrane. GPCRs are coupled with G proteins. G proteins are of two types, GQ and GS. G proteins when bound to GTP are on and when bound to GDP are off. So in our last lecture, we have already talked about GS mediated action and in this lecture, we will talk about GQ mediated action. Action of GQ. When a peptide hormone binds GPCR, it causes a conformational change in the GPCR. The GPCR then activates an associated GQ protein by exchanging the GDP bound to the GQ for a GTP. It activates the GQ protein. GTP bound GQ will bind phospholipase C or PLC enzyme on the cell surface and activate this enzyme. Activated PLC hydrolyzes PIP2 that is phosphatidyl inositol 4,5-bisphosphate into two second messengers. One is IP3 and the other is DAG. IP3 is 1,4,5-triphosphate and DAG is diacylglycerol. DAG activates protein kinase C. Protein kinase C or PKC phosphorylates various proteins and these proteins act on nucleus. They enter nucleus and help in transcription of specific genes. Next is IP3. So IP3 binds with IP3 receptor in the membrane of the smooth endoplasmic reticulum and mitochondria to open calcium channels. It will stimulate release of calcium in the cytoplasm. Free calcium bind to calmodulin. This calcium calmodulin complex activates protein kinase A or PKA and many other kinases. PKA phosphorylates various proteins. These phosphorylated proteins again enter nucleus and help in the transcription of some specific genes and those gene products help in the cellular function. This is all about today's lecture. I hope you liked the lecture. Thank you for watching my video. 